All right, guys, we're back, and uh, it's hot, and uh, yeah, 2010 Outback. Uh, I'll show you guys how to remove these sun visors, and then update this mirror to home link. I'll show you guys that too. Um, on the visors, on this 2010 model, they got two screws up here with this plastic cap cover. I mean, realistically, it's just, you know, I'll show you guys. It'll make more sense. Just take a little pick and come around the edge, not to ruin your he headliner. Um, it's got these little clips right here that hold it together. Um, and just you can get the pick around it this way and just you know swirl around it. This will come off. You have two little screws here. That's pretty much how I take this take this visor off. Very simple. Um, let's remove this guy. It's a Phillips. Okay. So this model's got lights in here. So it's gonna have a wiring. There's a little pin right here. Just push and it'll pull out. That's it. Get your new one, same design going back in. Just you know, put this in, plug it in, just shove it back up in the hole. And what I'd recommend is put this screw in with the hand screwdriver. Don't tighten it all the way. Put this one in too. Make sure you get both of them in, you know, and then close it, put, put the clip right here, then, then tighten them. Other than that, it's pretty self-explanatory. These are for sale if anybody needs them. Um, so it's not going back on the car. Same for the passenger side, and we'll do that video down the road so you guys can see it, but that's the driver's side. 